Hey guys, I'm here to do a tag. I've never did a tag on my channel, so I wanted to come and do one today. The tag I'm gonna do is the It's My Hair tag. I think it's only right that my fro is out today to do this tag. Yeah. And if you see me looking down, it's because I'm looking at my laptop so I can get all the questions. So let's get started with the first question. Why did you start your hair journey? I started my hair journey because I had very damaged hair. I started taking care of my hair in eighth grade it was severely damaged and short. I literally had no hair. Uh, I could probably put my hair in like the tiniest ponytail and I just, I couldn't take it anymore. So I started to go to the salon and I started to get my hair done like every two weeks. I found a professional hairstylist and I absolutely love her. I miss her so much. If you see this, Melissa, hi. Um, she definitely made my hair grow and took care of my hair. If it wasn't for her, I really don't know where my hair would be at. I definitely started a hair journey because I wanted my hair to be healthy and to, to be long and to see how far it can grow. How long have you been on your hair journey? So if I've been on my hair journey, and FYI, I've been on two hair journeys, two different hair journeys. Um, so since eighth grade, so that would be in, I think 2005. Yeah, 2005, so it would be 10 years I've been on my hair journey. Are you relaxed, transitioning, or natural? I am completely natural. Um, like I said in the previous question, I've been on two train, two different hair journeys. At first, I was relaxed, and then I transitioned to natural, and now I'm fully natural. What is your length now? Um, I guess I'll just do one in this video because I really don't know. So the front. Here, um, the side. I love you guys. Can see that. The side goes to here. The side. I don't know what inches it is right now. So yeah, there you go. What is your hair length goal? I don't technically have a goal in mind. I just want my hair to be healthy and to see if it, to see how far it grows. If it grows down to my butt, hey, why not? I just wanna see how long it can grow. What is your hair texture? Okay, um, about these hair texture terms and terminology and whatever. Um, I don't really believe in hair, categorizing hair. I feel like uh, whoever's natural, you're natural and that's it. Uh, I would say that my hair is very kinky. I have coils, I have curls and that's really what I all I can say. I, I don't I don't go by like 4A, 4B, 7, 10, AQ, whatever. I, my 
here is Kinky Koli in. I don't know what I was saying. Eh, eh, eh. Oh, my hair texture. Uh, yeah, Kinky Curly Koli. That's all I can really say. My hair is very densely packed, but my strands are, I have fine to medium to thick strands. What do you prefer, health or length? Like I already said, I prefer health over length. If your hair is long and breaking off and you have different lengths of strands, I, I just don't, I don't get the point. Like what's, what's the point? Yeah, so a uh, health over length. If you could only live with one hair product, what would it be? Wow. One hair product? Uh, one product for my hair? Um, one product. Okay, um, it would have to be my shea butter mix. I do make a homemade shea butter mix and I do add a lot of oil, so I would use that. Yeah, if I only had one product. Please, please don't let that happen. What's the worst product you've ever used? Worst product I've ever used was, I believe it was Cantu, the brand Cantu Shea Butter, is it called Cantu Shea Butter? I don't know, Cantu, the or it's in like an orange bottle, like an orange brand bottle. And it was like a curling custard. I don't know, it was very clear. It was, it was like a cluster, custard. It was, I guess you can use it for wash and go and stuff. But I used that on my hair and my hair felt so disgusting. It was hard, crunchy, and I had tons of flakes. So uh, that was definitely a no-go in my book. What is your go-to hairstyle? Um, <laughs> my go-to hairstyle is definitely a twist out. Twist out is very easy for me to do. It takes the least amount of time and I get the best definition. So most definitely twist outs. I love twist outs. Are you a product junkie? I'm not a product junkie. I do right now only have a small handful of products, but I do like to try new products. So I wouldn't say I'm a product junkie. I just like trying new things for my hair, but no, I'm not. If I could only live with like the few products that I have now, I would be perfectly fine with doing that. How often do you trim your ends? Okay, I trim my ends when my hair feels like it needs a trim. So that could be anywhere between three to four months or even six months or like three to six months or something like that. Sometimes like if I'm doing a lot of froze, like if I'm doing a lot of braid outs and twist outs and stuff like that continuously throughout the months, then like within three to four months, I will have to do a trim because I do get a lot of single strand knots. But if I'm protective styling, my hair's twisted up, I'm wearing a lot of turbans, then I probably could go without a trim like five to six months and I'll be fine. I typically can't even last that long sometimes because like I really hate knots on my strands. Oh, it's so annoying. How often do you use heat? I do not use any heat on my hair. The last time I used heat on my hair was when I big chop and that was in October of 2013. Yeah, I big chopped October 2013. That was the last time I used tea and my hair was straight and pressed out. So that was the last time. Do you take supplements? I do not take any supplements. None, none at all. Your favorite oil? My favorite oil has to be coconut oil. I'm in love with coconut oil. Coconut oil. I love coconut oil. Coconut oil is so bomb. 
It's so bomb. My strands love coconut oil. Who is your hair crush? I don't really have a specific hair crush. I literally love all curls. I literally love all natural hair curly textures. Like, it doesn't matter. You could be loose, wavy, you could be tight, kinky, you could have no curl powder. I just love natural hair, I just love it. So I don't have a specific hair crush. How long does it take you on wash day? Guys, if I'm like motivated, like in my head, like bugs, all right. Come on, we gotta get through this. Come on, let's do, do this, let's do this fast. Let's do this quick, let's get it done. Uh, it probably would take me about three to five hours to do it if I'm like, oh, okay, I gotta hurry up because I usually let my deep conditioner sit in my hair for like an hour or two, or hour to two hours because I really like, I need that extra moisture to my hair. I need all the moisture I can get. So I usually do that step. So, so like maybe three to five hours, but sometimes like if I'm being slow or like if my hair is super knotted and uh, I have it detangled in like days, or in like weeks, it can take me up to seven hours sometimes. And it's very hard, it's very hard. I try not to be sad about it, but it hurts. But I, I, I'm the type of person that I can't just rush Sometimes I just can't be rushing through my hair. Like my hair gets so knotted and tangled so quickly. Like I have to literally finger the tangle and do it thoroughly because I don't want to just be pulling my hair out. So yeah, that's that's how long it takes me. The worst thing that ever happened to your hair. When I was relaxed, I needed to get my hair done and I needed a trim, like my ends were very bad and I could tell because I had a lot of split ends and at the time my hair was very long. My hair was maybe raw strap length at the time and I went to this lady because it was she was recommended by my friend. It was actually my friend's mother, so at the time she was my friend. And it was her mother who did it and she said, yeah, my mother's good. You should go to her, she's not gonna charge you as much and she's gonna blah, 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 she's good and all that blasts, blasts, and all that stuff. And so I went and I'm just like, I'm telling her like, my ends are bad, can you just give me a trim? And I, I don't want you to trim off too much, just trim what's needed, like, that's it. And I'm telling you, my hair, when I got up out that seat, first off, she put uh, rollers in my hair so I couldn't actually tell, actually. When I got up, I couldn't tell because she did rollers. I did a roller set and the, the, the curls were so tight so I couldn't really tell. So I was like, okay, all right, it looks nice. You get what I'm saying? Roller sets usually look nice, uh, it's easy. A couple of days later, I wanted to straighten it, I guess, and I straightened it and I was looking at my hair and I was like, I was really upset because I really nourished my hair to get it to that length and she took it off. It was literally like right here. My hair was right here and it was to my bra strap and she cut it to my head. I was so heated. I was so heated. I was so mad. And I called her up and I was just like, yeah, well, um, you took off too much. She was like, well, you needed it. She's like trying to make excuses. I'm like, lady, like, oh. I was I was really upset. So that was like the worst thing that ever happened to my hair. I was I was devastated that day. Even though I do like my hair when it's short, so I did like the cut. I liked it, but it wasn't supposed to be a cut. It was supposed to be a trim. There's a big difference. Do you dye your hair? And if so, what color? I've literally only dyed my hair one time in it was with Kool-Aid. Uh, don't laugh at me, guys. It was like a long time. I was literally like 12, trying to be too grown, trying to do too much, and I dyed my hair and it was like red. But I don't dye my hair. I don't, I have never, since then, I've never put anything of a color in my hair, so yeah. Last question is, who do you tag? Anybody who wants to do this tag, just do it. That's the end of the tag, guys. Thank you so much for Stay in tune and 
watching the end of this video. I really enjoyed this tag. I've never did a tag and it was fun. It was really fun. You guys got to know me some. Let me know if you guys want me to do any more tags. Just leave your request down below and I'll see you guys in the next video.